boys and girls, it's Miss Kazikas here. And today we're gonna to be learning about theme and how to find the theme of a fiction story. So just a reminder from those of you who might have forgotten, theme is gonna be the message or lesson that the author wants you to learn. I can remember that it's the message because if I put a little box right here, the theme is the message. It's what the author wants you to learn after listening to the story. So when you think about theme, we're usually gonna be looking at fiction stories. It could be a nonfiction, a true story that happened, but it's gonna be a story. So it's gonna have a beginning, a middle, and an end. When I'm trying to find the theme of a story, there are certain questions I like to ask myself to try and figure out the theme. Remember, we really can't find the theme until we've finished the whole story. So first things first, make sure you finish the video, the story, or the book that you're reading before you try and find the theme. The first question I like to ask myself is what did the character do to solve their problem? So for example, in a book, A Bike Like Sergio, we found that Sergio had to tell the truth in order to solve his problem. So from there, I can tell the theme is always tell the truth. Another question you can ask yourself if you're stuck is how does the character change from the beginning to the end of the story? So I like to think about finding Nemo at the beginning of the story, the dad was really afraid of everything. But as the story went on, he became brave. And when he was brave, he was able to find his son. So how did he change? He was brave. What's the theme? Be brave and do things that are scary for you. The last question is, what did the character learn? Sometimes you might read a book and you see that your characters learned a lesson. In the book, Chrysanthemum, she learns that it's okay to be different. It's okay that her name is different. So that character learned it's okay to be different. And so you as the reader, that's the theme you learned. You learned it's okay to be different. Now, before I go on to show you how I found the theme, you need to make sure that you've watched the video Coin Operated on YouTube. If you haven't watched that video yet, I want you to pause this video and go back to your choice board. Make sure you watch the whole video before we find the theme together. So if you haven't watched Coin Operated, please make sure you go back and watch that video and then you can come back here and press play. I hope you enjoyed that video. I thought it was a funny, fun little thing to watch. And I'm gonna find the theme of that two ways. First, I'm gonna find it with the problem and the solution. The problem is what goes wrong or what the character wanted. So in that story, the character, can you think about what he wanted? He wanted a cool ride. And you could say he wanted a cool ride, he wanted a cool ride to the moon, but he wanted to go on that machine because he thought it was gonna be really fun. Now, when he first put in that coin, nothing really cool happened. So now I'm thinking about my solution. Well, how did he get that cool ride that he wanted? Well, he had to work a lemonade stand and did he just go and spend all that money as he was earning it? Mm -mm. He saved his money too. So he worked a lemonade stand and saved money. So that's what the character had to do to solve his problem. When he worked at the lemonade stand and saved money, he could go on that really cool ride to the moon. So what did the author want us to learn? Well, the theme probably isn't work a lemonade stand because that's not gonna help me in my whole life. I'm not always gonna be able to open a lemonade stand, but I can 
work hard and I can save money. So sometimes you need to work hard for things you want. So that could be the theme of this video. Work hard for things you want, or you could say work hard for things that are special. Now, I can also find that same theme or a similar theme by thinking about how my character changed from the beginning to the end of the story. So in the beginning, what did the character do or think? Hmm. So in the beginning of the story, he only put in one set, right? He used, or one coin, one coin for his ride. That's what the character was doing at the beginning of the story. At the end of the story, he had to do what to get that cool ride? He had to work hard. Did he get it immediately when he started working hard? Did he have to wait a little bit? He had to wait a little bit. So he had to work hard and be patient. And when he did that, he got a cool ride. Or he got to go to the moon, right? So in the beginning, he used one coin right away and the ride really wasn't that special. But in the end, he worked hard, he was patient, and he got a really cool ride. So what changed about the character? He became patient, he waited, and he worked hard. So I could say that the theme is that you, you have to work hard and be patient for what you Right? So our character learned that if you work hard and be patient, you can get what you really want. Or if you work hard and you're patient, you can get something that's really cool and really worthwhile. So I was able to use problem and solution. And I was also able to think about the beginning and the end to figure out the theme. During the story, the type of ride that man got on the, um, on the rocket ship changed because he was a hard worker and was patient. So now I've learned from watching that video that if I work hard and if I'm patient, I'll probably get things that I want in life too or things that are cool, okay? So now it's gonna be your turn to try. I'm going to read you a story and then I want you to pause and I want you to choose a strategy to try and find the theme. Okay, boys and girls, we're gonna read a really short story. It's called The New Scooter. As I'm reading, if you can see it on your screen, I want you to follow along with me. Matt put on his helmet. He stepped onto his new scooter. The red metal shone in the sun. Matt rode his scooter around the park. The scooter moved really fast. Matt smiled. He loved his new scooter. Matt's friend Evan ran up. Matt, can I ride your scooter? Evan asked. No way, Matt said. It's new. I don't want to share. I don't want to share it. Matt rode his scooter some more. Then he got bored. He looked around the park. Evan was playing with a toy plane. Hey, Evan, Matt said. Can I try your plane? Sure, Evan said. He handed the plane to Matt. 
Matt suddenly felt bad. He did not share his scooter with Evan, but Evan shared his plane with Matt. Sorry I didn't share my scooter before, Matt said. No problem, Evan said. Come on, let's try the plane. Okay, boys and girls, I'm going to leave this up on your screen, and I want you to find the theme. Ask yourself, how did the character solve his problem? Or, if that doesn't work, how did the character change from the beginning to the end of the story? And if that doesn't work, think, well, what lesson did our character learn? I want you to write on a piece of paper or something near you what you think the lesson of this story is. And I want you to include why you think that. Why do you think that that is the theme of the story? Once you have that written, then I'd like you to press play so we can go over the answers together. If you need help remembering the questions, you can go back to the earlier parts of the video to remember those questions that help you. Okay, press pause and press play when you're ready. The theme. It is more fun when you share with your friends. Let's go over how I found that theme. In the beginning of the story, the new scooter, there was no sharing. And as he played with his scooter by himself, Matt was bored. In the end of the story, Evan shared, and then they both had fun. So the author can't really, wouldn't make sense if the author was telling me to share your scooter because Evan didn't have a scooter, he had an airplane, and you and I, we might not always have scooters or airplanes. The theme is something you can use in lots of parts of your life. But what changed in the characters? They shared. When you send your teachers your theme on your own this week in the choice board, they don't want the just one word like share. They want you to write nice, complete sentences. Here's what I wrote. The theme of the story is to share with your friends. I know this is the theme because in the story, Matt got bored. When the boys both shared, they both had fun. I started my paragraph saying what the theme was to share with your friends. And then I wrote two sentences telling you how I know. I know because in the story, Matt got bored. And when the bo boys both shared, they both had fun. This week, as you try and find the theme of stories, make sure that you're writing in complete sentences when you send it into your teachers. I hope this lesson helped you. Have a great week.